morning, everyone. Welcome to the Lighthouse Ministries reading of the Nativity Story. Everything you will hear today is straight out of the King James Version Bible. So sit back and enjoy the true story of the birth of our Savior, Jesus Christ. Luke 1, 26 through 38. And in the sixth month, the angel Gabriel was sent from God to a city of Galilee named Nazareth to a virgin exposed to a man whose name was Joseph of the house of David. And the virgin's name was Mary. And the angel came in unto her and said, Hail, thou hast. Thou that art highly favored, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. And when she saw him, she was troubled at his saying, and cast in her mind what manner of salutation this should be. And the angel said unto her, Fear not, Mary. For thou hast found favor with God, and behold, thou shalt conceive in thy womb, and bring forth a son, and shalt call his name Jesus. He shall be great, and shall be called the Son of the High, and the Lord God shall give unto him the throne of his father, David. And he shall reign over the house of Jacob forever. And of his kingdom there shall be no end. Then said Mary unto the angel, How shall this be, seeing I know not a man? And the angel answered and said unto her, The Holy Ghost shall come upon thee, the power of the highest shall overshadow thee. Therefore also that holy thing which shall be born of thee shall be called the Son of God. And behold thy cousin Elizabeth, she had also conceived a son in her old age, and in his the sixth month with her, who was called Byron. For with God nothing shall be impossible. And Mary said, Behold, the handmaid of the Lord, be it unto me according to thy word. And the angel departed. The birth Noel, the angel did say, was to certain poor shepherds in fields as they lay, in fields as they lay, keeping their sheep on a cold winter's night that was so deep. Noel, 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 born is the King of Israel. They looked it up and saw a star shining in the east beyond them far and through 
Corinthians chapter 1, verse 18 through 25. Now the birth of Jesus Christ was on this wise, when as his mother Mary was espoused to Joseph, before they came together, she was found with child of the Holy Ghost. Then Joseph, her husband, being a just man, not willing to make her a public example, minded to put away her privately. But while he thought on these things, behold, the angel of the Lord appeared unto him in a dream, saying, Joseph, thou son of David, fear not to take unto thee Mary thy wife, for that which is conceived in her is of the Holy Ghost. And she shall bring forth a son, and thou shalt call his name Jesus, for he shall save his people from their sins. Now with all this was done, that it might be fulfilled, which was spoken of the Lord by the prophet, saying, Behold, a virgin shall be with child, and shall bring forth a son. They shall call his name Emmanuel, which being interpreted is God with us. <clears throat> then Joseph, being raised from sleep, did as the angel of the Lord had bid him, and took unto him his wife. And if you are not, then she had brought forth a firstborn son, and they called his name Jesus. Away in a manger, no crib for a bed. The little Lord Jesus lay down his free head. The stars in the sky looked down where he lay. The little Lord Jesus asleep on the hay. The cattle are lowing, the baby awake. But little Lord Jesus, no crying <coughs> he made. I love thee, Lord Jesus, look down from the sky. And stay by my cradle till morning is. Be near me, Lord Jesus, I ask thee to stay. Close by me forever and love me, I pray. Bless all the dear children in thy tender care, and take us to heaven to live with thee there. Luke chapter 2, verse 23 forward. And it came to pass in those days that there went out a decree from Caesar Augustus that all the world should be taxed. And this taxing was first made when Quirinus was governor of Syria. And all went to be taxed, every one to his own duty. And Joseph also went up from Galilee of the city of Nazareth to Judea and to the city of David, which is called Bethlehem, because he was a past and lineage of David, to be taxed with Mary, his betrothed wife, being great with child. And so it was that while they were there, the day were accomplished that she should be delivered. And she brought forth her firstborn, firstborn son, and wrapped him in a swaddling place, and laid him in a manger, because there was no room for them in the inn. And there were the same country shepherds keeping watch over their flock by night. And lo, the angel of the Lord came upon them, and the glory of the Lord shone round about them. And they were so afraid. And the angel said unto 
say that you're not holding out. I bring good tax as well as gold, which shall be set all people. So unto you is born this day to be a sight, a sight which is Christ the Lord. And it shall be a sign to you. You shall find the babe wrapped in swaddling clothes, lying in the manger. Joy to the world, the Lord is come. Let earth receive her King. Let every heart prepare Him room. And heaven and nature sing, and heaven and nature sing, and heaven and heaven and nature sing. Joy to the world, the Savior reigns. Let men their songs employ, while fields and floods, rocks, hills, and plains. Repeat the sounding joy, repeat the sounding joy, repeat, repeat the sounding joy. Luke chapter 2, verses 8 through 20. And there were in the same country shepherds abiding in the fields, keeping watch over the flock by night. And lo, the angel of the Lord came upon them, and the glory of the Lord shone about them, and they were sore afraid. And the angel said unto them, Fear not, for behold, I bring you good tidings of great joy, which shall be to all people. For unto you is born this day in the city of David a Savior, which is Christ the Lord. And this shall be a sign unto you. Ye shall find the babe wrapped in swaddling clothes, lying in a manger. And suddenly there was with the angel a multitude of the heavenly host, praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest, and on peace good will toward men. And it came to pass, as the angels were gone away from them into heaven, the shepherds said one to another, Let us now go even unto Bethlehem, and see this thing which has come to pass, which the Lord hath made known unto us. And they came with haste, and found Mary and Joseph and the babe lying in a manger. And when they had seen it, they made known abroad the saying which was told them concerning this child. And all they that heard it wondered at those things which were told by them by the shepherds. But Mary kept all these things and pondered them in their hearts. And the shepherds returned, glorifying and praising God for all the things that they had heard and seen as it was told unto them. Silent night, holy night, all is calm, all is bright, round yon virgin, mother and child, holy infant, so tender and mild. 
seen his star in the east and are come to worship him. When Herod the king had heard these things, he was troubled, and all Jerusalem with him. And when he had gathered all the chief priests and scribes of the people together, he demanded of them where Christ should be born. And they said unto him, In Bethlehem of Judea, for thus it is written by the prophet, And thou Bethlehem, the land of Judah, Art not the least among the princes of Judah, for out of thee shall come a governor that shall rule my people Israel. Then Herod, when he had privately called the wise men, inquired of them diligently what time the star appeared. And he sent them to Bethlehem and said, Go and search diligently for the young child, and when ye have found him, bring me word again that I may come and worship him also. When they had heard the king, they departed, and lo, the star, which they saw in the east, went before them, till it came and stood over where the young child was. When they saw the star, they rejoiced with exceeding great joy, and when they were coming to the house, they saw the young child with Mary, his mother, and fell down and worshipped him. And when they had opened their treasures, they presented unto him gifts gold, and frankincense, and myrrh. And being warned of God in a dream that they should not return to Herod, they departed into their own country another way. The beautiful star of Bethlehem Shining afar through shadows dim, giving the light for those who long have gone, guiding the wise men on their way unto the place where Jesus lay. O beautiful star of Bethlehem. Shine on, shine on, oh beautiful star, beautiful star of Bethlehem, star of Bethlehem, shine upon us until the glory dawn. Give us a light to guide the way unto the land of perfect day. O beautiful star of Bethlehem, shine on, shine on. O beautiful star, the hope of life, guiding the pilgrims through the night. Over 
the mountains till the break of dawn. Into the light of perfect day, it will give out a lovely ray. Oh, beautiful star of Bethlehem, shine on, shine on. Oh, beautiful star, beautiful, beautiful star. Was the night before Christmas, God glanced over the earth. He looked to and fro all over its dirt. They missed it again, he said with a sigh, a heavy heart and a tear in his eye. I gave them my son so they could be free, my greatest gift to them from me. They traded me in for a man in red, a little tree and four crown set. How do I save them and make them see my love is complete, my grace is free? How do I help them when all they know Talking snowman in a box with a bow. Maybe next year they will stop and see the biggest gift of Christmas a little child can be. 